Welcome to Exploring with D-Rob. Let's go. today been sidelined for about a week went out one day last week did a little wildflower photography jacked my knee up a little bit so kind of been nursing it ain't really been out to get any adventures in so i figured i'd get out today try to do some little easy stuff that wouldn't be too rough on my knee uh, mountain laurel should be in full bloom by now Hit up a few uh, overlooks, a little short hikes, we'll do a little photography. So we'll see what we can come away with. First stop today, we'll go up chimney top. Hopefully, there's still a little fog around. A little sky interest, maybe. Let's see what we can come away with. Got some mountain laurel looking good. Yeah, chimney top all to ourselves this morning. And unfortunately for me, anyway. I don't see a cloud in the sky. I also don't see any fog over the river either. So not sure it's going to be uh, much of a photo outing out here at Chimney Top this morning. But Got plenty of birds singing this morning anyway. Look over to the left here. Here we got half moon rock. Pan over to the right just a little bit. Got Hanson's Point. Go on over to the right a little bit. Got Pincham Tack Gap. Revenue's Rock. Step on over here to the right. Off in the distance. You got Raven's Rock. If you look just to the right of that a little bit. Courthouse Rock. Pan back down the river here. Pretty familiar to everybody here. Cloud splitter. See a lot of the icons of the Red River Gorge from here at Chimney Top. Not feeling very motivated with this cloudless sky, but I might get the camera out and see if I can come up with anything. Not real sure I got anything I'll be happy with, but if anything turned out worth anything, here's the shot. I think I may head back up the trail here a little bit and go to one of these little side offshoots that face over towards a uh, half moon and see if maybe we can get a little, uh, mountain laurel for foreground interest facing that way naturally i came back to this overlook on this little side shoot off the trail and no mountain laurel close except for way over here where it would be obstructed by the evergreens 
So, let's see if I can come with anything here that's not just all blue sky. If I get anything, here's the shot. One last look over at Half Moon. Now I'm gonna head back up here to the trail. Might photograph just some mountain laurel along the trail. And if I don't find any interest in there, probably just head on back out the road and maybe try to find a big leaf magnolia to photograph. Getting into the summer months, a lot of people will be wearing shorts. Just uh, keep your eye at the edges of the trails because for whatever reason, right in the edge of the trails always seems to be a hot spot for poison ivy. If you're not familiar with the area and have time, uh, across the parking area from Chimney Top Overlook is Princess Arch Trail. Nice little arch down there, definitely worth checking out if you've never been. For the sake of time, I'm gonna head on back out Chimney Top, see if I can't find me a big leaf magnolia to photograph. fall to trying to photograph the big leaf magnolias is that they are pretty much all overhead. As I was driving back out chimney top, saw this heavily trafficked path out through here. I don't have nothing pinned in the area, so I thought I'd come check it out. I'm sure there's some campsites out here. Kind of hoping there might be an east-facing overlook out here at the end. It's a little short ridge, so we'll find out. Oh, well, it was a bust. No significant rock outcrop or anything to go down to to photograph. Did find a nice little patch of mountain laurel on bloom though. I miss this big deadfall. Here's the large campsite. If you look out towards the road, you can see the truck. Probably not the uh, 300 feet from the road, but anyway, if you ever stop and check this out, be sure to watch your footing if you head off any of these little offshoots. They all look like they've uh, been pretty well used for poop trails. And there's plenty of poop unburied. I think I might head on out 715 here out towards Sky Bridge. Maybe stop by some of the overlooks off Sky Bridge Road. If there's not a whole lot, a whole lot going on out through there as far as interest. Go ahead and make the 71577 loop around towards Nata Tunnel. Maybe there'll be something down along the river or something. Up here on Sky Bridge Road, coming over to check out Devil's Canyon Overlook. Got some mountain laurel in bloom. Not sure if there's any over here closer to the overlook or not. And unfortunately, still all blue skies. Look around here for a minute and see if I can find anything on try to attempt an image of. If not, 
head on out to the next stop. One last look from Devil's Canyon Overlook, overlooking the parts of Corn Creek Valley down towards the Red River. I don't think I came away with any award-winning images, but here's what I got. I've mentioned this in other videos, but Devil's Canyon overlooks a great place to catch a sunset. I'm gonna head on around the 71577 loop towards the Nada Tunnel now. If anything catches my eye, I might try to stop and get a shot of it. If not, we'll just make the loop around and head through the Nada Tunnel. Not a ton of color in the woods right now besides green, but these fire pink caught my eye, so I thought I'd stop and photograph them real quick. Here's the shot. got time and since it's easy we'll run down here to the suspension bridge and see if they've started repairing it yet get an update on it they're just a weed but sometimes weeds have nice flowers too so we got the camera out and took a shot of these Well, unfortunately, as I suspected, no progress on the suspension bridge yet. You could have been the real one. I'm gonna go wrap up the visit with a stop by La Cabana for lunch. Heading through the Nada Tunnel now, headed out of the gorge. Didn't really want to push it too much today, since I've uh, still been trying to take it easy on my knee. Hopefully I'll be back to normal soon, get out on some regular adventures. Got a little bit of photography today. Seen a few overlooks. Pretty much just a little blundering around in the gorge today. Next video, I'll be back to normal and seeing some of the off trail attractions, maybe. Hopefully, you enjoyed today's adventure. If you would, be sure to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't already, consider subscribing to the channel. And I hope to see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching.